for Rec Lab News here at uh, Jack Rabbit uh, Boxing Gym in Long Beach, California, catching up with the great, talented Ashton Silva making his U.S. Yeah. debut on February 26th in Pomona, California. Ashton, is great seeing you. How's everything going? Same here. It's been great. It's been great. How about you? Good, good. Um, it, it's been a long time in the making. Um, I met you a couple years ago when you made your pro debut uh, in Mexico. You've had all your fights in Mexico. Uh, there were talks about you trying to make a U.S. debut sometime earlier last year. It's finally here. What's going through your mind knowing that all this uh, Long Beach <laughs> fan base are going to get to see who Ashton Silva is here in your area? I mean, that's basically what is it. Like, you know, um, everybody from Long Beach or you know, wherever they come from, my fan base is here. Okay. Uh, like this, that's the most exciting part is to be able to showcase my talent in front of like uh, more like my from my own country in, in my own country okay. actually. All right. So this is your hometown. This is where you grew up. Uh, where we here we have a background of all these trophies that you won um, since. At what age did you start joining um, sports? Uh, inside the gym, I started. I was like seven, eight years old. Okay. Uh, outside of it, my dad been training me like since. I don't know when, but just before, before I even um, thought about boxing. Uh, anybody, any of the trophies in particular you're the, the most uh, proud of? I, I see a bunch of uh, Golden Gloves tournaments, uh, say, pictures, gloves. You want to go over any of those trophies? Uh, this, I think this is my last, like, last amateur fight. Okay. It was like, it's a team trophy. Right. Uh, we came in first place, it was an Oxnard. Um, with it, yeah, basically, we just we got first place as a team. Okay. That, I think that fight meant the most for me because um, that's my last amateur fight. And we, overall, we all accomplished a, a big goal. So you're off to a 6 and 0 record. Um, which of those fights have you learned the most, or is it pretty much the same routine when, when um, you go through a, a, a training camp fight week and you just start trying to figure out who? What the opponent? How you how to beat the opponent since the first round? Uh, it's kind of it's been the same since I kind of first started boxing. Mm -hmm. um, just going there with the mindset that you can win, um, and just studying the opponent, take your time. It is like slowly, of course, I've been growing and um, and adding new things from like you know my last fight. Like I know now I'm more efficient in the body. Like that's where it's. Um, where I usually put down the opponents, so that's why I, I would say that's what you will be seeing uh, lots of body shots uh, throughout your career. Is so that gonna be uh, if it's if if it's there? If it's there, uh, you see the opening, you you go yeah, for it. Yeah, time. Okay, February twenty sixth in Pomona, California, H uh, two Promotions, along with uh, Mark Nation. Uh, talk to us about the whole card itself. Any of your uh, Team members uh, fighting on that on that card as well. Uh, we have one, Cecilia Brooks, and another Trent. He's the main. He's the main card. Trent is a uh, heavyweight, yeah, right? Heavyweight. Okay. And Cecilia, uh, 140. He fights at 140. So we have us two on the card. Same uh, from Jack Rabbit. So that's a big thing. Okay. Um, a few months ago on, on our last interview, I was asking you what weight class you will be fighting on. You said 126, 130. Which, which uh, weight class will you be fighting on February the 26th? 126. 126. Are you going to be sticking around at 126? Uh, are there plans yes. of moving? You say you, you've been fighting six rounders since uh, second fight. Second fight. Yeah. Yeah. Is that the plan or do you want to go ahead and jump to an eight round uh, fight um, pretty soon? It's more of like a, a team thing we come like you know come with come up with, but for the most part I'm trying to uh, stay 126 as long as I can before I start actually like growing because you know I'm still just turning 18. Yes. So okay. happy belated birthday! Yeah. Yeah. What did you do for your 18th uh, birthday? Uh, I went skating. Right. I, was, I went skating. Okay. Uh, first time you do that pretty often? Yeah, uh, actually my second. I mean I skated like outside, like at my grandma's house, but actually inside of. Uh, roller skating inside the like ring is my second time. What are the expectations of a young athlete like yourself uh, from a well-known high school like is Long Beach uh, Poly? All these athletes, but that high school hasn't really had a boxing, boxing. superstar. What, what, what? 
you feel any pressure on knowing that the Long Beach community will be following your career from the first time you fight here in the U.S. to uh, maybe there'll be other promoters, uh, TV, cars, anything. They're, they're yeah. gonna be they're gonna be yeah. pretty much following you every every move you make. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's, I mean, I've been had pressure since you know growing up. Mm -hmm. uh, for the most part, uh, I accomplished mostly everything, mm -hmm. and uh, it's been it's been a long ride. Just um, from just being an amateur coming up to being a pro, and just throughout that ride, I kind of noticed that there's no pressure because I got so much support from the city. It's like uh, they believe in me as much as I believe in myself. So uh, I mean, I don't have no no haters. Well, I, of course I do, but I don't have no haters like directly, you know, near me. Right, so right, right. everything is positive. So when I go in the ring or anything I do, I got support behind me. Okay. So there are there's a big fight card going on in Vegas uh, this this coming Saturday. Uh, Thurman against uh, Barrios. Uh, Leo Santa Cruz is making uh, his comeback. Do you keep track of all those fight cards on your spare time? Anybody uh, in particular yeah, that you keep an eye on? Like I will watch it. But you know, I'm, I still have a, a lot, of, a lot of other things to do. Okay. Like still school, um, still getting myself in shape. Uh, right. Well, staying in shape and preparing for my next fight, and it's still being a kid. So. Would you be uh, walking uh, to your uh, high school celebration with all your classmates once you graduate? No, yeah. yeah, of course. How, how, how's that? Uh, how's that going? How, how, how does that make you think? It is, it's kind of still crazy because, like, I mean. At the same time, it's not because I always kind of like I always say I keep myself humble. So okay. uh, I picture myself as just another student there. Uh, it's nothing like uh, the spectacular that that I picture myself is doing from uh, like a different other, every other kid in the school. Like it's kind of the same for me. So do they do they treat you the same like, way, or do they know you're out for big things in boxing? I'm waiting for you. Uh, they do, but for the most part, I try not letting them, like, you know, do that. Because, like, as, like I was saying, I kind of just, at the same time, like, I just want to be kind of like a normal student at the same time. Right. So, uh, they still, like, say certain things and, like, you know, try to give me, like, leverages and stuff uh, like that. What's your favorite subject in school? Uh, now, mm, business. No, no, it's before it was math, but now it all kind of goes together. What business you want? You want to know how to like run your own yeah. your own career? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, do you expect uh, a huge crowd on February twenty sixth? Oh yeah, yeah. It's already how how are the crazy. ticket sales going? Uh, it says already halfway sold okay. out. So, all right. I picture now is probably like almost sold out. So. Um, and people still talk to me about you know buying tickets, so it's probably great. Okay. You were you were there last week uh, in attendance at that location. Mm -hmm. uh, what was the uh, uh, fan? Uh, uh, how, how do you, how were how did they know uh, and saw who Washington Silva so was and you know the big expectation of you making your US uh, debut? You saying how do they know me? Yes, um, probably from is like from social media for the most part. I think that's where. Uh, and from fighting myself, you know, because mm -hmm. um, I'm not just like, you know, a social media fighter. I actually, you know, do do it. Okay. Um, are there plans of you fighting pretty soon after your February 26th? Because I saw on Box yeah. Rick that mm -hmm. there's another fight scheduled for you around March. Is yeah, that hopefully. Okay. Hopefully. So uh, that's the plan. That's so, yeah, <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, how, how is your dad? Uh, Getting ready himself mentally, uh, physically, knowing that you're making your, your debut on the 26th. Uh, I'm, I think he probably feels the same way as I do. It's just, uh, I mean, it's more so exciting, but it's not like so much pressure. We kind of been doing this forever, so it's just um, another step closer to our goals. Best, uh, best move, best punch by uh, uh, by himself. Me. Yes. I mean, Something that when you hit your opponent, you say yes, it, it, it's flush. Yeah. This guy's going down, or or you, you see that he's hurting, and you go out and and, and, and try to try to hit the same spot like again, my, like my uh, go-to punch. Right. Uh, 
I can't tell you. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> All right, so you're gonna be landing some of those yeah. go-to uh, punches yeah, on, the, on the on the on the February. To, uh, I'm gonna yeah, be there, yeah. believe me. So, all right. Um, any what, what's the message you wanna say to the fight fans for your upcoming? Fight? Uh, I'm to, excited. I wanna I wanna see yeah. you do your things. Yeah, just like you know, just people like just come come support. You know, I'm uh, especially for from Long Beach. You know, this is where it's at. The future is right here. So, uh, just come support me. I'll put on a. Uh, great performance, y'all. All right, you, you guys heard it from the uh, Ashton uh, Silva himself. February yeah. 26 is just around the corner. Do not miss his fight. Great mm -hmm. U.S. debut for this young, talented man. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you, H2 uh, of Promotions, for this opportunity. See you then. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Thank you. Thank you, guys.